Hey everybody, so welcome back to another video and today we're going to be reviewing and unboxing Justine Dancer from Ever After High. So she is one of the three new girls that came out. So she comes in her newly redesigned box and packaging. So if you want to see a detailed um, take on the box and the redesign, check out my Farrah review, which I've gone into detail there. So it's really pretty. The colors are vibrant. I love that. So on the front, there she is. There are some little character specific decor in the corners. There's a castle diary and here is her artwork over here so these seem to be featuring the close-up of their faces rather than their full body artworks like the other ones she is daughter of the 12th dancing princess here is the side and here's the back so you can pause and read her little Q&A session if you'd like I'm gonna slowly skim through there and on the sides they're also promoting Fabel Bunny, Farrah, and Justine herself at the bottom as well. Alright, so here she is, and first of all she comes with her gold brush and the gold stand with the silver um, waist claps to match with her belt and she comes with her diary as well which have now turned into these little tiny books as opposed to the beautiful bookmarks that they used to put on the other one so this is a disappointment on these new one I will tell you that I've said it firmly in my Farrah review as well and another thing is that it doesn't say whether the character is a royal or a rebel right now and because it doesn't mention on the cover or I'm not sure if you're supposed to read through it to find out and it doesn't mention on the box either and she is a royal, I checked on the Wikipedia, but doesn't say on the box, so I'm not sure what's up with that. But anyways, let's get on with the review of the doll. So she is really gorgeous. So first of all, I love seeing dolls of color, and uh, her eyes are just green, and it just pops. It's so vibrant. So starting from the top, she has her silver tiara, this little one piece, but I like the design. And her hair is dark brown, and it's insanely smooth and soft. So far with Farrah and her, I'm really impressed with their hair. So that's a good thing. You can see how soft and bouncy it looks. And moving on to her makeup. So she has red lips and gold eye makeup, both on the top and the bottom, and has a little tube of glitter running across. It's kind of like a glitter tube glue kind of thing, not with glitter and paint mix for the other doll. So that's kind of a disappointment, but still, it works. <laughs> And moving on, she has her silver necklace, and then for her outfit, it's a one-piece little dressy skirt. And for the top part, she has these puffy white see-through um, sleeves here. And then moving on for her bodice, she has this yellow print with a darker yellow shade of patterns on top. And then she has this intricate, really huge armor, like almost... Um, waist piece here or belt um, that has a little a pink accent in the middle looks really detailed at, at first I thought it was actual fabric when I uh, before I opened her and then moving on first skirt it's the same pattern as the top but more like has more of a um, red ribbon ish kind of little flurry things going around and top with a little sparkly black fishnets on the edges really nice trimmings and then she has for accessories she has her gold bracelet that looks like a flower with a little leaf detail and she also comes with her purse and finally finishing off she has her silver shoes which she is a daughter of the 12th dancing princess so she's gonna have to dance I don't know how she's gonna dance with these heels but I guess she's a pro <laughs> so I really like they give her like these heels opposed to the normal ballet kind of shoe because Duchess already kind of has those ones so this is really pretty so overall I would give her a 4 out of 5 just because the cheapness of the glitter eye makeup that they gave her and then of course with the downgrade of the bookmark but other than that she is fantastic she is gorgeous and I love her all right everybody so thank you so much for watching for my review I really hope you guys enjoyed the video so if you did you can thumbs up and subscribe for more videos on my channel you can also check me out on Instagram at disneyboy21 for more photos but right now thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all soon in my next video bye